Okay, in this clip, we're just going to focus on the habit of scanning the ice. Uh, in hockey, it's more commonly referred to as shoulder checking. Uh, but the same premise applies. So we're just going to spotlight number nine in yellow this entire shift. And we're just going to watch how many times he scans shoulder checks. As we roll that, it's tracking back into the zone, scanning for threats in red coming into his space. He's also scanning the ice for opportunities if the puck was to turn over where he could go to either make himself available or to stretch the defense to create space underneath. So he's already scanned twice on his track back. comes into defensive position here on the left wing. Scans there as someone crosses in front of his face, tries to get a stick right away just in case. Scans again, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, So scanning can also be used on offense. So as we back this rush up, he's just going to take a look at where he might be able to attack space as he's coming up the ice. So he takes a look and sees where 88 is right in the middle of the ice. He's going to work to get in this blind spot behind him and then look to get available to this puck. But he's making sure that no one was over there first in that wide lane, and now he's going to go attack. He reads that turn over here and immediately presses this guy on the wall, able to keep his puck in. Scans again before he makes his move, trying to work inside the dots, become available for the seam pass. Scans again before he gets the puck to see at what speed guys are coming, how many guys are coming towards him, and where his next play might be. 